Today we have been sent the fantastic, fun and useful Waffle Bowl by Smart, a new way to serve food and desserts. And now let's dive straight into this product. So using our Smart Digital Scale, which we will review soon, we made a simple waffle batter using 1 cup or 125 grams of gluten-free flour, half a tablespoon of sugar, half a tablespoon of baking powder and a pinch of salt. In a separate bowl, one cup or 239 milliliters of milk. One egg and one tablespoon of vegetable oil. Whisked them together, then added it to the flour mix and stirred it into a smooth batter. And here is the machine, very stylish in retro red. So after preheating this machine for three minutes, we are now ready to make a few waffle bowls. Do remember that this is our first time. As you can see, we put the cooked waffles on an upside down bowl, which helps to get them to retain their shape during cooling. Steam are plenty, and when the steam clears, it's ready to be taken out, approximately three and a half minutes. And here it is. It's hot, so we need to use a silicone spatula to remove it. Let's make another two of these. They might not look picture perfect, but this is our first time and they smell so good. It really is a simple machine to use and easy to clean as well. Let's fill one with ice cream. And if you have some melted chocolate handy, then add that as well. And here we are, a perfect, freezeable dessert. Let's make a fruit salad, outside with the kids. It is plain sailing to get the kids to enjoy fruit when the bowl is edible. Now here is an innovative idea for these waffle bowls. Using a smart, cascading chocolate fountain, use it to get chocolate into the bowl. Now you can have your fruit salad with chocolate and with a simple bamboo pick, you can eat it while walking around. And here it is in its entirety. Let's try it. Let's not forget the sides. A fantastic party trick and everyone will be intrigued. So there you have it, a great machine. It's a striking red waffle maker that stands out with its stylish and sturdy design.